Next stop, Trek Expo. Space, the final frontier. Thousands of sci-fi enthusiasts come to meet with their fellow idealists. They say they love sci-fi because it's a form of escapism and to boldly go where no man has gone before. <laughs> you love watching Star Trek? Yeah. Because? I just love it. To hang out. It's a community. I grew up watching it when I was a kid. In 1968, 1969, that's when I got to watch it. So do you watch it all the time? Not all the time. All the time. I have a job. <laughs> <laughs> it seems strange to be on the outside world. Like, oh, right? I know. We used to look yes. at it the same, <laughs> same way. Star Trek was the first TV show to show an interracial kiss. Mm -hmm. And was that a huge deal when that happened? For my time. Yeah. Are you two married? Coming on 32 years. Well, congratulations. And so this is the secret to it? Whack each other around with these? Uh, sometimes. Yeah. <laughs> Are you serious? You guys do that? <laughs> now that's good start. So it's a feel good thing. Yes, it really is. It really is. It makes me feel good about myself. It makes me feel good about the future. And so when it's a community, what do you guys talk about? Do you talk about Star Trek, Star Wars, science fiction. And why do you love Star Trek? Probably because of the, the just the cool ships and the colors and things like that. We work it every year because it's a family thing that we do. Yeah. They chronicle some of the things that debuted on the show that now exist. Cell phones one of the most popular ones. Tricorder scanners. Yeah. We have CT scanners. You know, phasers. We have stun guns. I got my Captain Kirk and my Mr. Spock. May the force be with you. Sure. Come visit me at flythecoop.tv or Fly the Coop on Facebook.